The Alienware 17 is an epic gaming laptop with dynamic reflexes. Designed with incredible new features, for gameplay so visceral, you'll have to decide how deep you're willing to go. With Toby Eye Tracking, you can take aim with your eyes, unlocking reflexes for a host of gaming functions. Enable mind-bending VR with the next-generation NVIDIA 10 Series graphics, and optional dynamic overclocking with the latest and most powerful Intel Core processors. Engineered with hinge-forward design and premium materials, aluminum for thinness, magnesium alloy for rigidity, and copper for performance, featuring an Alienware Tactex keyboard with N-key rollover. The Alienware 17 is the ultimate evolution of portable gaming technology. How's it going, guys? Welcome back once again to Gamer Connect. My name is Captain Arya, and up next, what you are going to watch right now is the CSGO Challenge powered by Dell and Alienware. I'm joined by Himanshu Guntevar, the product manager for Dell and Alienware. We're going to be talking about some of the most powerful and elegant gaming laptops in India before we turn to a fun gaming activity where you guys get to be on stage with none other than Team Brutality. How's it going, Himanshu? Yeah, hi, Shan. So, as you spoke about today, we are going to talk about the Dell laptops, the Dell Gaming and Alienware that we have. We have a G3, G7 and Alienware here. What we want to go in and deep dive is, as all games have different requirements, so which product is suited for which game? Is yeah. that what we want to look at today? And what's great about these laptops is, uh, you know, they cover a wide variety of possibilities, yeah. all the way from entry level to the most powerful notebooks you can get in India right now. So whether you're just looking to try out gaming, want to game while working, yeah. or want nothing but the best yes. so, while you're on the go. Yeah, so when you look at the array of la la laptops we have, we start with the G3, which is there, which is power packed with the en entry level NVIDIA graphics card, which is 1050, goes up to 1060. And they're powered by i5 to you know i7 graphics card, i7 Intel processor, which are there, which are required for the gaming. So if you look at G3 here, it's for games which require less graphics. You know, like games like uh, you have Dota, you have Fortnite, you have FIFA, and Dota. The being fun the, games where it's yeah, not yeah, too like, serious or not too yes, demanding yes, in the same yes, way. Yes. Right. These are games that you'd want to play at college or just at home or you're out for the weekend or just have a little bit of time yeah, to get just, into. If, if you look at Dota, Dota is a game where you. Uh, are not looking for a you know very graphics intensive work but you need a machine which can pull in data faster internet is good so g3 is a product definitely for the people who want to go for dota you get about 100 fps and, easily and on it's this. also the perfect size if you're looking for uh, a portable solution yeah, right yeah, yeah. the g3 in fact is so nice and compact it doesn't even feel like a heavy notebook at yes, all yes it's just a little bit of weight added to your bag so it's, and it's i love like, the weight yeah especially. and it's just like an amalgamation of the gaming uh, laptop with the performance laptop so that you can use it for dual uses mm -hmm. and then you know if you can play dota dota goes up to 100 fps you go and play fortnite or maybe cod you get 70 80 fps from medium to high setting that you do so that's what it we look gives at, you yeah. just about enough to enjoy different types yeah. of games because if you're not too serious yes because each game has different requirement you know if you are a dota fan you ought not to spend something like a alienware in the mm -hmm. uh, in the way of buying a laptop that you're gonna buy yeah. for it yeah so this is Folks, the Dell G3 gaming laptop, yes, yes. available in various specs, as you yeah, said. Yeah, it goes from it starts from 7390 plus GST in India mm -hmm. and goes up to about a lakh plus. But then, yes, uh, there are people who want to play better games, who want to level up their gaming. That's when we have a G7 here, okay. which is uh, powered by i7 1060 6GB graphics card. You know, you can definitely do bigger and intensive gameplay on this yeah. and have a smooth gameplay when you're selling. Uh, predominantly games like Watchdog. Uh, PUBG. So uh, this is like more of those you want a bit more on your eSports yeah, side yeah, e and want to really enjoy AAA games but at the same time you don't want a very high-end gaming laptop. Yeah, because you maybe a battle royale title where you have multiple people coming in. Mm -hmm. So your CPU and GPU both play important role because there's a there's an in instruction going which has to be received faster which is CPU mm -hmm. and there's another part which is graphics that's getting rendered. Yeah. You don't want lag on that so that's, that's how we think that G7 suits into PUBG better and then you can get about 80 plus FPS on this which is I like... Mean, we all know how PUBG is a very demanding yeah, game. Yeah, demanding game. And you've yeah. got a notebook that can give you the performance and what's great is, if I'm not mistaken, the G7 also comes with a Max Q1060. Yes, yes. Right, this is the most efficient form of yes. the GPU made for notebooks so that it gives you peak performance without overheating, without yeah, making extra noise. That, that's another issue with the laptops, you know, gaming laptops. If it heats up, your performance tends yeah. to go down during the gameplay mm -hmm. and your FPS comes down and then you're like, what is happening? 
So we kind of wanted to take care of that, and that NVIDIA helps it greatly when they bring in a Max-Q to put in the device, yeah. which reduces the thermal output of the product, yeah. So, so that's, that's amazing. So this is, folks, the G3 and G7 Seven, notebooks yeah. from Dell Gaming. Now, what's great is these are notebooks you can game on, but at the same time, if you're traveling, if you're working, if you're just going to college, these are notebooks that blend right in. They've got that amazing sleek design, so they don't look out of place, right? You, you can use them for both work so and if, for gaming. If you see the design language grows, so like G3 is something which is more of dual. Mm -hmm. When you look at G7, we have tried to give a touch of gaming, but still kept it like a performance kind of a yeah. touch, but then it has the G gaming you know, language to it. But then you, then the next product that we have here, of course. and you know, which we called as built as a tank, which is Alienware, it's a level up in your gaming. So it's not, it's not this, your this general gaming laptop. This is the best laptop. of the best yes. that Alienware has to offer. Now, you know, the G3, G7, they've got a lot of learnings, and those come from, of course, the Alienware yeah. side of things. The most iconic brand in gaming. They've been making some of the best yeah, see, notebooks. If, if you look at any professional gamer, he would, I mean, without even doubt, go and look at Alienware and say, "This is my machine." Mm -hmm. And why not? It goes from i7 to i9, yeah. highest processor that's available, highest graphics card, which is 1080 8GB graphics card. Any demanding graphics, demanding games can be played on this. And at plus, the, it's got the high refresh rate display. Yes, it's, it's got a 120Hz refresh rate. It's got something called as Tobi eye tracking. All that is available, which is a very advanced technology that we want to put. Even the thermals on this are the cryotech thermals, where you have three-phase fan motor so that the sound is less. The fan blades and are just... And it also operates at cooler temperatures Yeah, because while doing more yes, than other notebooks. Yes. Because it has a blade which is 0.2 mm thin. So, you know, the air kind of swifts very faster. And, mm -hmm. you know, you have good outlets of air. It pulls air from back and side and throws it back, so which and, is and good. And what's great is, you know, these notebooks, like you said, are built like tanks. They're sturdy. In yeah. fact, last Gamer Connect, when we were in Coimbatore, we celebrated uh, 22 years of yeah. Alienware. I was jumping on one so you see old the notebook, machine, and it's perfectly fine. It works. Why? Because it's built for heavy-duty use. It's built for gamers. Uh, keeping in mind the fact we throw our bags around sometimes. Yeah, because see, the game when you play, you get kind of get into intense gaming, and your machine has to be sturdy enough. Mm. So we use kind of two or three metals, three or four metals on this. You have a magnesium alloy, and you've got you the copper inside. You got the structure inside yeah, to and, make and sure you, it's sturdy. You still reinforce keyboard. You cannot push it down. See mm -hmm. other laptops, if you kind of try to push it, it goes in. Yeah. So if you see here, it's kind of sturdy, and the mechanical keyboard. Sorry, the keyboard, the keys are so mechanical that you can go up to 2.2 mm down, mm. which is a good feel, tactile feel that it gives. And this kind of laptops, when you are professional gamers, or let's assume an eSport game like CSGO, you know, and you, need, you cannot lag in that, because a second of lag and you're killed. Yeah. That's, that's how demanding these uh, games are. So this gives you up to 170 and plus FPS. So, you know, it's got the high refresh rate, and then to you know, support that, you've got the specs that are going to give you top tier performance. You don't have to feel inferior to a desktop at all. So if you're serious about pro gaming and have to be on the move or travel a lot. Yeah, it has to be mobile at the same time. So I think this is the best gaming device for a, you know, a pro gamer, a high-end performance gamer that needs, you know. And games like Witcher 3, and uh, which are very graphics intensive, you know, the storyline and everything is so engrossing in Witcher 3 that you need something which is good. So then you go and, you know, hands down go you and say... You don't want that dip in performance or frame rate yeah. that will kind of break the mood. Yes. Right? And, so then, and then you see that we have this Alienware monitor, which are the 24-inch monitor, oh, yeah. which is 240 hertz. If you plug in that, then your experience goes to a different mm -hmm. level. So, you know, back when you, if you get your home or office, you can ramp it up once again by yeah. connecting it to those monitors. So, Alienware and Dell together were a complete range of products to suit almost any gamer's yes. needs. All the way from those who just want to try out gaming, but need a laptop for work, or those who need to game. So, it's, it's a gradual progression, Ishan, like you see, this, this is like a, for a gamer who has just started gaming. Yeah. And when you upgrade and you say, okay, I want a G7. Then you upgrade and you say, I am a pro gamer. So mm -hmm. we want to cater to everybody who is there. So you know, you can start with a G3 and then go up to an Alienware device. So guys, that's the full lineup of notebooks available from Dell and Alienware. Now to talk a bit about his experience, how he works and games as a professional on this very Alienware notebook and to have a little bit of fun on stage, guys, I'd like to invite Ankit and the rest of Team Brutality. Guys, can we have a huge round of applause? I think they forgot they have to be on stage. Ankit, let's go. <laughs> Maybe they're building a game strategy. Guys, let's there. go again. Huge round of applause for Team Brutality. Come on, all of you, all of you. Guys, it's Team Brutality. I know he's the face of it, but you guys complete it. Come on. Oh, come on, front and center, guys. Let's go, let's go. Guys, can we hear it for Team Brutality? Woo! All right, so. Okay, I'll go 
All right, Ankit, so you've been here all day in Bangalore. How's the atmosphere been meeting your fans? I know you haven't had even one minute to sit down. Actually, I sat down and signed a few autographs and mobile phones and t-shirts and you signed mobile mouse phones. pads and yeah, but wow. I told them why are you spoiling your mobile <laughs> phones and they were saying like… What, resale value will increase now. Yeah, resale value. But the atmosphere has been totally electric. Uh, every Gamer Connect has something special. Mm -hmm. The fans are, you know, they come out with their energy and start supporting with full force. That's why I say, right, fans like family. I don't… I mean it from here. I don't do it for the likes or subscriptions. but. These guys actually mean a lot to me. They have given me this life. Mm -hmm. I'm earning through my passion. I'm a professional gamer and you know, now I can go to my parents and tell them that gaming can be taken as a career. So these are the guys who have given me everything. In fact, guys, for those of you that had a chance, you got to attend a special workshop in the morning on various ways you can make a career out of gaming from pro esports to streaming to casting and more with them. And then tomorrow, if you're interested in a bit more on Ankit's personal journey, in gaming from growing up and to where he's come today. There's another special ch session. You can check out the GamerConnect.in app for that. Now, Ankit, we've been here. We've talked about these amazing laptops. Uh, we've given you guys a bit of a lecture. Now it's time to have fun. How many people actually want to play CS with Team Brutality? Right? The, the only people who have their hands down are the people in Dell shirts. They're like, nahi, yaar, aaj nahi. Right. So here's the fun thing we're going to have a 2v2 challenge, right? I've got some chits back there. I'm going to draw two names, two Team Brutality members. And then they will choose one teammate each out of you guys. And then you will come on stage and play first to seven, 2v2 match, yeah? First to seven. So, and that's going to be broadcast live for the world to see how good you guys are at playing with the team you love. Does that sound good? I can't, can't hear you. Does that sound good? That's what I like to hear. Now, do, do we need a caster? Maybe. Maybe. All right. So, I've got some cheats here. Right? I'll ask Ankit himself to pick out the two names. His name is also there. So, they're going to be random. All right. First person. All right. First person, guys. Oops. Oh, Ricks. And it's Ricks! All right, who's going to be player two now? I think Ankit's just making sure my name is not playing. I'm not playing today. Yes, Slovin. All right, it's going to be Ricks versus Slovin. Guys, come up front, take one step forward. All right. You get to pick your teammate. All right. Guys, who's interested in playing with Ricks? Who wants to be on Ricks' team? I think I'll pick that guy. Which row and which seat? Second, second row. Second row? Yeah. First guy? All right. Come on up from behind. Until then, slow in. Guys, who wants to be player two's teammate? I'll, I'll pick that guy. The one with the red thingy. You. Oh, yeah. okay. The guy in the Nike hoodie. Come on up on stage, guys. We're going to have some quick introductions. And then, until then, Ankit, could I trouble you to set up the server on the last one? This side, last one. Yes. All right. Come on up. Come on up. What's your name? Gotham. Gotham. How long have you been playing CS Gotham? For a year. For a year. Have you been following Team Brutality closely? Yeah, yeah I have. How did you get started with CS Go? Uh, I used to play CS 1.6 after I got a better laptop, actually Dell G7. Yeah, there we go, guys. <laughs> people are using these very laptops that people are going to be competing on right now live for you guys. So after I got a better laptop, I started playing CS Go. How did you find out about Team Brutality? Uh, ESL Pro League. I, was, I saw them participating, so. Okay, so that's Gotham. Can I get your name? Ahar Pathak. Ahar, all right, Ahar. How long have you been playing CS? About a year. About a year. How did you find out about Team Brutality? Um, like a friend of mine told me like, that like I should follow CSGO, so I started following these guys. And what's your favorite thing about Team Brutality? That um, they play as a team. Yes, that's pretty good. All right, guys, so we've got yeah. No, no, no. You're on this side. You're on that side. Yeah. So, who thinks Team Rix is going to win? Team Rix? <laughs> Rix? All right. Now, I need to hear you. Make some noise. Team Rix! Yeah. Right, that's a few people. Team Slowin! 
Come on, make some noise, guys. All right. So th I'll, that's that's a bit of coercion. I think Team Ricks is the favorite here, right? Uh, all tab. <laughs> we'll check. We'll check. We'll try. All right. We're just setting up the server. Give us a few seconds, and we're going to start up. Wait. Oh, we gotta download a map. All right, guys. We're gonna quickly download a map and then get it onto all the devices. All right. Till then, Ankit, let's take some questions from the crowd, shall we? All right, guys. Does anybody have questions for Ankit? Anyone wanna ask? No, no, not you. You you meet him every two weeks at a different event. All right, because anybody want to take this chance to ask Team Brutality some questions? No? All right, Ankit, let's start with your practice regime. Right, to be a pro at CSGO, you got to play a lot every day. But you just jump into a match or is there more you do? Uh, before jumping into the match, I play with bots. I play deathmatch for a bit. Like so he plays hour. with people like me? <laughs> Every day to warm up. <laughs> no, he's lying. He's way better. So that's what we do: play death match, warm up, or uh, Rix normally goes uh, into the map and you know just surfs around, walks, feels the map. Uh, then we directly jump into the game and you know, start playing. All right. And do you guys always practice as a team, or do you practice individually? So individual practice is always on every day because our schedules are a bit too tight. So everyone, whenever he gets time, we just play. Uh, but evening, we make sure that we practice as a team at least for two hours. Okay. Every day? Minute. Every day. So at least two, three maps against Asian teams or Indian teams. And this is scrims or do you like just go pugging? Uh, these are scrims. Alright, so you go find the right opponents and practice against high tier players. Yeah, so we make strategies, then we try to implement those strategies against those Asian teams. Because the level in China and Asia is a bit higher than ours. So we learn a lot from those guys. Okay. And uh, we watch our own demos after the matches to see what mistakes we've made so that we don't repeat them. Okay. And what advice would you have to, you know, budding CSGO players interested in going pro? Um, I would tell them to, you know, keep practicing and uh, tournaments are going to keep happening now. The scene is improving. There's uh, a lot more opportunity out there. Yeah. You, Gamer Connects, you have seen how the crowd, you've seen the competition. More uh, brands have jumped in, yeah. This, this weekend's prize pool alone is like 29 lakhs. 29 lakhs, so that's ILG, huge. over four games. I remember when I used to play 10, uh, 10 years back, you know, the prize money used to be a mouse pad or a keyboard <laughs> or maybe 5,000 rupees. Now it's 5,000 rupees, by the way, would have been like first prize after a six month long tournament. Yeah. Right. And that too, I, that time I used to lose. So expenses were there, but now it's improving. And uh, as I keep saying, you continue studying, working and side by side, you can do this because this is still improving, growing and it will take some time to get consistent. But platform like uh, Gamer Connect, you know, this is the chance to prove you can, you have various brands out there. You have uh, platforms like the Tell Alienware 1v1, 2v2. So you can compete with the best. There are streamers. Gaming is not just professional gaming, right? Yeah. It's streaming like you. You are one of the best streamers in the country. So people should learn from you. And that's what we are doing in, in the, when it comes to streaming. And which of these notebooks do you use personally? I have the Alienware 17. I have uh, the Dell G7. I have the Dell Inspiron 7000. What is it? So I have, uh, I, but my, my favorite is uh, definitely Alienware 17. Because you mix a lot of music as well, right? Yeah, you that's know, we right. spoke about a lot of heavy work and you travel a lot. You know, this guy, at least 20 days a month, he's not at home. Right, that's a good month. Right now, yes, I've been getting a lot of opportunities when it comes to gaming. I'm doing brand endorsements, I'm traveling, doing events, shooting. Touch wood. I hope this keep ha keeps happening because uh, this is what I always dreamt of, uh, living my passion and mm -hmm. making my family proud. So now when I go with my family somewhere or when I'm going with my mom to get vegetables and stuff, you know, people are there who come behind uh, shouting venom venom with their parents. I used to think that now their parents are going to slap me and say, you have ruined my child's future. But it's the opposite now. They say, you are my son's inspiration and I'm very proud that he has an inspiration like you. You are his role model and stuff. People now have started making uh, their parents watch my streams, watch yeah. my social media, they read my posts and stuff. So it's helping a lot. And also, you know, the, the best thing about this guy is, you know, he's not just making a career out of gaming, he's setting a good example, the right example. He doesn't encourage anybody to drop out of school and pursue gaming. 
you do your studies, you do your hard work, but you game on the side. You keep at it. It's it's not easy, right? You got to put in the hard work. And he set such a good example that parents are willing to, you know, allow their kids to look up to him. A lot of parents like travel quite a bit with their kids just to meet you. I actually met a family who traveled, you know, 12 hours in a bus to meet me in uh, New Delhi. Over here also when we were doing a workshop, you know, there was a dad who had come and he was listening to what I was talking and he clicked a picture with me. So, now I'm not scared of families. I know uh, they a respect. Earlier it's like, you've ruined my son's life. And now they're like, you know, we're very happy our son has someone like you to look up to. One more thing is that, you know, platforms like Gamer Connect get you these big brands like Alienware, Dell, Corsair and all. So, people, previously they used, they never used to Google Amkit Venom Panth. Mm -hmm. They used to Google Dell, Alienware. These were brands. Okay, now this Venom guy is tied up with these brands. So that authority comes. Okay, now he's a legit guy. Yeah. But now people have started changing their perception. Okay, this guy is doing it. Maybe gaming is actually something in the country. Okay, what was your favorite fan moment? I think one of the coolest ones I thought was um, he was getting on a flight somewhere and uh, I think one of the stewards on the flight, he's like, wait, you are Ankit Pant. I know you and I want a picture. Yeah, so and I, I thought that was really cool. So I uh, went, I was on a jet airways flight and uh, I was walking down the aisle and I, when I was about to sit, that guy called me and told me, excuse me, can you come here? I went inside and I was like, I have my boarding pass, I didn't get any lighter or stuff, I don't smoke, why is he calling me over here? And he was like, I'm a big fan of yours, I watch your streams. Uh, I was like, okay, because in that, that moment uh, struck a me. airport if someone takes you aside, you're scared. I've done <laughs> something wrong, I'm getting kicked off my flight. But this was a... <laughs> yeah, so uh, what I have uh, seen uh, when there are celebrities on the plane, right? These guys go and, you know, take selfies, give them flowers and stuff like that. So that was my moment where he actually came to me, took, took, a, self took, a, took a selfie with me, uh, made me sign a uh, jet airways, uh, I think, uh, some uh, book or stuff like that. Mm -hmm. And he was very happy that I'm on that flight with him. That's why I posted about it. So that's one of the coolest things I've seen happen. And it's amazing how much love you guys show Team Brutality and... He really does mean it when he said you guys are like his family because almost everything he does is for you guys. Absolutely. No one can change that and never will. All right, guys. So we're going to take a short break while these laptops are set up and then we're going to be back on the big screen. But remember, there's going to be more than one match, right? Four or five of you are going to get a chance to come up on stage, talk and play with Team Brutality. And of course, the winner of each match will, will give him some nice Alienware swag, not laptops or maybe some caps, right? Does that sound like a good idea? Yeah. Does that sound like a good idea? Yeah. All right, we'll be right back. First 2v2 match, can we get some noise? <laughs> Alright guys, so this is a chance for the fans to play with Team Brutality and of course, take home some goodies. Oh, oh, Art Fan taking a bit of damage. Down to 7 HP, not where he wants to be at this point. Yes. <laughs> it's a 2v1 and they're not going to have to make it back. High fives coming out. 1-0, first to seven wins, remember. First to seven. Oh, oh, quick taps, quick taps, gets the kill. Oh, slow win comes in with the clutch. Rix, what's happening? It's cool. Okay, guys, he's saying it's cool. Guys, is it cool? 1-1. One, one. First to seven. Things are heating up. Can I distract him? Can you distract him? You mean like this? <laughs> no. <laughs> wait, he still got the kill. <laughs> so guys, I covered his... Oh, wait, the fan with the clutch. Fist bumps all around, 2-1 to slow in. It's like, guys, Ankit doesn't know his own players. What's happening? Oh no, we are going to come back. Okay. 
He wants to come back. Oh. He is cheating. Spawn killing. Spawn killing. So guys, the word is that Slowen is cheating. I'm not sure if he's had time to install any certain apps on this laptop. Maybe. Can I all tab and check? Or you're going to tell me to move away? No. He's using no, the freeze no. time. No? All right. 3-1 to slow in. Ouch. This is at a point where it's starting to get away from Rix's team. Ooh. Wild spray there. Yes. Wild spray there from slow in. End situation. Oh, one down. It's our fan versus Rix. Rix, uh, wait, let me just unplug this for you. Can I? No? Intense game of Counter-Strike. Yes. Oh! Well, I mean, that was a bit expected, but he's come up with his clutch plays. Don't worry, no pressure. If you get to at least five, I will give you my cap. All right? There's two more. You have to lose, huh? I, I, you distracted him. It's like my idol just spoke to me. Oh, Ankit, what's the score? I can't read. It's That's why I took him in my team, na? Oh. You know the reason, oh. right? I was trying to motivate him. Reverse psychology. I was trying to motivate him. See, he's very motivated. You know, some leadership skills there from the captain himself. That's how you run the team, right? Good. Very good. He's hopping. See. He, he wants to insult Rix. 3-4. Hey, seems like the comeback is on Ankit. I think Ankit just checking how long before he finally loses. <laughs> Ooh. That's why you don't make Rix angry. Oh, oh, that was a sneaky play. You know, right? You're technically not can supposed I, can to. Can I tell him the, the HP? Side. You're trying to be cool, huh? You're trying to be cool, bro. 4-4. Four, four. Now you read the score. Okay. Should we make it interesting? Sudden death. Sudden death. Whoever wins this next round wins. Fine? Okay. Fine? Alright, we got a yes from both sides. Now captains. he'll start camping, I'm sure. See? Oh, oh, Rix opens it up. You don't mess with Rix, bro. Oh, so that is Rix for the win. And I need a supporter. <laughs> he wants a supporter. I, I was your supporter. Get him his pie. Come on. Next time. King that. All right, so how did it feel to win with Rix? He carried me, so it's cool. But you got a few kills, come on. Yeah, that was cool, man. Yeah, you, you snuck up on him, you distracted slow in, and you allowed Rix to get the win. It's teamwork. So who's the best player? Rix, of course. Good boy. Rix, of course. You are learning. You have right, a bright right, future. Right, good show, good show, guys. Thank you, thank you so much. Thank you. I hope you had fun. How was it, how's it feeling playing with slow in? You came up with one clutch play. Yeah, that was just, you know, I don't know how, how I can. Just trying. No, so just now you have learned, right? Who's the best player? Obviously this guy. Don't take his side, you lost. <laughs> <laughs> alright, alright. So that was just the first one, guys. Who wants to play next? Guys, can I get some noise? <laughs> alright, let's draw our next set of brutality captains playing the 2v2 challenge. Fits in, eh? Let's give somebody else a chance. QQ, it's cheating. Okay, fine. Mix it. Okay, fine. I have my ace ready. Alright, Ankit, pick up two chits. You know what? You pick this up is, one. This is difficult. I pick up one. Tere kone? Tere tu bol. Tere kone? Tere tu bol. Guys, who do you want it to be? Venom. 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 <laughs> when Venom is near, you know who is next to him. <laughs> <laughs> Guys, Ricks. second player is Rix. <laughs> All right, guys, come up and pick your teammates. We let Rix go first, you know. Champion advantage. Champion. Now everyone wants to play. I think I'll pick this guy. The Kula master. Cool. All right. Come on up from the back. Both risky, are Come on, pick one.
please don't hit me all righty all right come on let's talk with rick's teammate first what's your name uh, vinay vinay yeah how long have you been playing cs vinay four years four years four years oh uh, yeah <laughs> man's been playing longer than me you're in trouble all right how did you hear about team brutality yeah that's the best thing we had till now and that's the best you know best best everywhere fans like family all over so you're going to be competing with rix against captain courageous himself you love me no what you love me right no no oh, you won't let me win he loves rix not in game yeah he's rix's best Since friend how long you've been playing i'm like 6 uh, 6 six, six years oh 6 years 6 six six years. years two years more bro oh condition zero good so we can defeat them right yeah. good you know rix was like you know i got i got a king of ace <laughs> i mean king of spades you're like nope i got the ace of spades <laughs> All right, guys, please take your stations. Quick reset on the server. All right. Yeah okay they need about 60 seconds to work on their settings One more game one more game after this yeah okay we'll try one more after this who do you think is going to win one second wait 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 come on all right team rix can i hear you Rix not today not today team vanam <laughs> all right i think we have our fan favorite oh man's like googling his settings wow he's actually googling his settings i've literally never gone into console commands it's probably why i don't play so well take your time bro we need to win I think I think he's going to write SV underscore auto win for me. Right? Okay. All right, we set. Are we set? All right. So No, not MP. Oh, MP. Right server restart is in effect. Let's go second 2v2. Huh? Yeah, we're good. To, we're good to go. First to 5. Right? First to 5 wins. Wait, did Venom just die? Oh, you're still setting up. Come on, man. That's cheating. That's cheating. No. 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 Come on, man. You don't need settings. He needs the sensitivity. You know how important that is. Let's cut him some slack. All right. Now, for the last and final time, Venom versus Rix. Let's go! Come on, excitement! No third map after this. No excitement. No third try. Who's excited? much better all right first round under way oh oh friends it's it's okay it's a team game it's a team game don't worry it's not a try out you're here for fun it's the best of 5 venom's up by 1 i think rix got lucky last time super serious here oh so 2v1 can captain clutch it oh 1-1 one, one. what's happening here rix you feeling good yeah yeah it's all good yeah easy ankit you hear that he said e z we will make them regret this day cuz lag lag Do we won again. 1v1. 
I got you. What do you say to Rix? Rix, please be nice to me. Wait. हाथ में राइफल है ऑप नहीं क्या डर ना आई ऑलमोस्ट ऑलमोस्ट नो 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 यू कैन चेंज दैट यू कैन चेंज दैट राइट टू टू फर्स्ट फाइव इज गोना विन इट Wait, did Rick just get his head blown off? Right away. <laughs> right away. That happens to me, but you know, you're a pro player. I was AFK, right? He was he was AFK with his face in his laptop. All right, back in it, back in it. I did it. Two, it's 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 only three two, right? First to five, not best to five. Got to win two more, Ankit. It's getting tense here. Oh, he's on an expedition. Ankit punishes him for that. Oh. Nice shot. You know good sport. I love that about brutality. They're all good sports. One match away from a loss. <laughs> the worst possible spawn on the most important map. Agija. Look at that man. When I'm so nice. Doesn't want the glory for himself but is forced to take it down. Guys, can we hear it for Venom? Hi, right, how's it feel to beat Rix? I want to thank my fans. Thank you so much for your support. I really appreciate that. This was very difficult. Thank you so much. All right. So, um how's it playing with Rix and Brutality? It's 20 FPS. It happens sometimes on custom servers, especially when you've got like 150 PCs on the same network. Yeah. It happens when with, you know in CS especially when you're Network goes a bit crazy. FPS does drop. Don't worry about that. But the experience of playing with Team Brutality, how's that? It's like, you know, words can't describe. Words can't describe. Absolutely, buddy. Thank you for playing. I hope you enjoyed it. You won. How does that feel? Yeah, I feel pro, bro. Huh? Oh, I feel pro. He feels pro, guys. Come on, guys. Can we hear a round of applause for them? <laughs> Venom was carrying him. Venom carries the world. Have you seen these arms? All right, last one. Let's pick Slovene and uh, Spy, the two young ones. Why not? Or maybe you went time. All right, pick one. <laughs> wow. All right, guys, Spy. Come Arun. Come on, here's round of applause. Oh. The married man, Arun Yuventa Kanpal. All right, come on up, guys. Come on up. Arey, first year. Arey, pehle, first year. Yeah, first year, bro. First year, come on, Arey, come on, come on up. Hi, I my name is Arun Yuventa Kanpal. I am very shy. I am married. I cannot talk. Really? So you said it for him. Anything you want to say to your fans? No? All right, guys. Who wants to play on his team? All right, you get to pick your teammate now. Him, him, him. All right, Ore. Let's go to the back. See, not here. Your chance. Come on up. Aage se. All right. Can we get quick introductions? Um, uh, my name is Rohan Yadav. Okay. Yeah. I, I, like, I'm playing CS:GO for more than three years. Okay. More, uh, almost as much as me. Three roughly. years. How did you find out about Team Brutality? Uh, like I used to follow Brutality when I start. Uh, like when I was in college, I used to watch all their matches. Uh, like I've been following CS:GO for a very long time. All right. Well, all the best. It's going to be fun. Please have a seat. Since when are you playing CS:GO? Uh, around a year or more. Oh, they have experience. Yeah, more. Let's see.
All right. We're gonna. Oh. No, you need to go 16 by 9. Go 16 by 9. One sec. All right, 60 seconds to change any settings you want. 60 seconds only. We will make them regret this day. All right, 30 seconds before we start. 30 seconds. Server restart. And we are live. Guys, last two we do. Can I get some excitement? All right. For those who are the most loud and cheering fans, I will give away a cap. Does that sound good? Who wants an Alienware cap? You already have one. That's what I like to hear. All right, let's go. Oh, well, we already went. Looks like they're up 1 0. Alright, what do you think is happening here? Who's your money on? The married man. Oh. I trust marriages, you know. <laughs> I trust your partner. Oh. oh. Hello, shot. this is not a tournament game. Calm down. He wanted like, he wanted five minutes to put in his settings. Five minutes, five whole minutes. He's spy, bro. I mean, he's like, I spy with my little eyes someone dead. <laughs> Boom. Now he has made the married man angry. Being a bit patient here. He never waits in tournaments like this, you know. Any patience, I doubt he's ever shown in a game that matters. <laughs> I <But> swear. Ja <laughs> 2 1. 2 1. I told you, married man. My bets are on I marriages. You know, I, th I think I can ask all day, but I won't get a comment out of Uenta. Pure din, Uenta, anything. No. It's very hard to get him talk on camera or in front of people. He's a man of few words. He lets his performance do the talking for Absolutely. him. Absolutely. Working like a team, speaking left and right together. <laughs> he has the basics of the game. You, you got good synergy him. here, man. I think you found like a sub. They're talking with each other. Hello, he's your yeah. opponent. Why are you talking? Kya you cannot talk. Match fixing or yeah. Concentrate. Kya? Match fixing or yeah, kya? He is controlling the recoil so nicely. Right, you went in a good position once again. 3 1. One more round. And I told you, you don't mess with the goal. Such a comfortable position. Best of five. We're at 4 1. Spy. Spy, my friend, what are Why? you doing? I spy with my little eyes a loss. Who agrees? There's still a cap to be won. One of you. Who'll get it? <laughs> they won. Ishan. It's over. It's over. The married man won. Married man and won. And now you have to make him talk. That's up to you, man. That's <laughs> so, they want to play more. No? <laughs> He's just frustrated that he lost. That, that's his traditional rush. So, that's it for this 2v2, guys. Come on up here. Come on up. Guys, can we get a huge round of applause? <laughs> I'm a little hard of hearing. Can I get some applause? Much better. So, how does it feel to win? No, wait, you didn't win. Oh, I... But it must have been fun playing with a member of Team Brutality. I don't, I think we played together once yeah. on live stream. Yeah. It was crazy. We were streaming separately. 
and we got matched against each other randomly and that's like my highest viewed video of all time why kushti brutality khel rahi thi he's just being nice and kind so how did it feel yeah it was amazing like to play against it was mirage them. don't worry thank you for putting on a good show i hope you had fun now to the winner how does it feel like winning with a member of team brutality you would like to thank your family yeah friends. i would like to thank my fans family friends and all and it was important cuz he is my classmate to defeat oh. him and brutality you guys are classmates yeah so now you going to tell your classmates yeah. i played with brutality and beat him and brutality ye to yaar this guy is like double so your prizes i'll give him cuz i feel bad for him now that we'll discuss later All right guys thank you so much for joining us Ankit any last words for your fans Keep supporting we are here because of you guys and if you guys keep praying for me and my team I'm sure we'll do wonders in the gaming industry All right guys thank you so much for joining thank us you. for this year's goal challenge huge shout out to all our participants and of course team brutality and Dell Alienware for making this possible this has been Gamer Connect subscribe to our notifications for more Alienware 17 is an epic gaming laptop with dynamic reflexes, designed with incredible new features for gameplay so visceral you'll have to decide how deep you're willing to go. With Toby eye tracking, you can take aim with your eyes, unlocking reflexes for a host of gaming functions. Enable mind-bending VR with the next-generation NVIDIA 10 Series graphics, and optional dynamic overclocking with the latest and most powerful Intel Core processors. Engineered with hinge forward design and premium materials, aluminum for thinness, magnesium alloy for rigidity, and copper for performance, featuring an Alienware Tactex keyboard with N key rollover. The Alienware 17 is the ultimate evolution of portable gaming technology.